guys good morning as you can see it's an amazing day the weather is absolutely fine it's a bit cold but we don't care the sun is shining happy day so we're going to radical bucks in belgium the french part of belgium the owner of radical bucks is gianni and he's a friend of me and i think it's a good idea to see what he does what car he what cars he owns and he's also just like me a big fan of star wars and we also ordered a very cool and fun item that he creates that he makes and it's time to pick it up so see you guys over there we are here Guys, we're at Radical Bucks with Gianni and we'll give you a little tour of his garage. Gianni, go ahead. <laughs> what do we have here? A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff? Lots of stuff, yes. What to, do you want to see? To begin, how much cars do you uh, think you own? I don't know. Uh, maybe almost 30, I think. I'm not sure. 30 is? Uh, not a bad amount of no, cars. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's this? Anyway, we have uh, several buses. This one is a uh, 66 buses uh, modified into a barnroom style bus. Like, uh, you know, the guy who knows, they know that there's a lot of difference between the late model and the early models. So there's a lot of modification made by myself, like the roof, the dashboard. It's yes. of course very low, you know. Slammed to the bone. Yeah, it's on its wheel. This is just for the persons who don't know too for, much. This, this is, is a static. This is static for the moment, but I think I, I okay. would need air ride. Right? <laughs> for the the good Belgian roads. Yeah, yeah, that's Let's right. Let's take a load, yeah. look inside. You can see the axle is dropped to the floor. Same in the back. Crazy, crazy, crazy. <laughs> bikes, uh, some bikes, bikes, some bikes, some old school bikes. Again, some buses. Low light, 56, first year of build. 56 low light, Carmen Ghia. Uh, early model, but not that early, like it's uh, 63 from US, comes from California. Okay, cool. Antiquita Beach, exactly. So this one has a little engine, you need to see. Yes. <laughs> the, it's only a 2.3 cc turbo draw-through. Uh, sounds about, I think, over 300 horsepower. That's so yeah, not too bad. That's not too bad. <laughs> it's cool. It's slow, it's in static. And it's dirty. <laughs> you know, completely rebuilt here a few years ago. Maybe for sale. I don't know. Just to keep in guys mind, just to keep in mind guys, all the cars in here are built by Gianni. Nothing is bought, everything is built, built from original cars or from scratch. Correct? Yeah. Right. You don't buy stuff, you build stuff. Yeah, I build it. I ride it. This one is blower on a 53 oval, first year built ovals. Uh, it's not a big engine, but it's really funny to drive with. So, yeah, it's cool. cool. It's really cool. I like this car. I it's love almost the almost my favorite. I love the look of yeah. the patina. It's on its uh, its original paint. Never been painted. What year is anywhere. this? 53. 53 yeah. original paints. Yeah. It's on the air, air ride system. Okay. Because cool. Because there used to be a lot of horsepower in it. Just before this engine, it was a turbo, okay. which is still there in the front, in the, the end of the garage. And this one goes uh, up to 250 horsepower. This one is only 130, but it's only funny anyway. It's it's yeah. more than enough <laughs> yeah. in a bug. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Cool. So you also have uh, you almost have all the more <clears throat> from Volkswagen scene. Uh, uh, 
at least uh, the one I like because okay. there's some I don't. But uh, yeah, you have uh, square backs, uh, you have uh, single caps. <clears throat> My 34, Type 34 Common Gear on air ride build uh, 10 years ago, still okay. on the way, still driving. You know, it's cool. This one is really cool. Is the beast like, still on the back seat? Yeah, there's a dead, a dead cat. <laughs> He's sleeping for 10 years now. Yeah, so, you know. <laughs> I don't want to make, make him wake up. Yeah, this one on air ride too. Everything has been restored, repaints, everything. So, you know, it's cool to drive. It's one, one of my favorite too. Uh, also, project like the the cab, it's in really bad condition, but needs to be rebuilt completely. It's very bad. <laughs> we can see it in the yeah. in the corner. Yeah, it's crazy. Everything is completely it's it's, it's terrible. But you'll fix I'm it. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it for my friends. So what time frame do you see this finished? I don't know. Maybe one, one year, two years. Uh, maybe two years. I think. Cool. Because needs, uh, he, he wants a, a turnkey car, so. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't think I could, I could uh, do it in, in one year only. So. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Another 53, uh, 60 panel versus. Uh, this one is uh, a funny one. Is uh, built in Dakota. It comes from Dakota. Okay. And uh, we built, we we bought it in uh, Holland and we're gonna try to make him drivable for e this year. Maybe okay. On the air, really low. Cool. I want it the lowest possible so I see the chassis is already been taken one, care of. Uh, some, some stuff that already been you know cool. Got it. Gianni, tell us a bit more about this one. This one is uh, one of my first car when I begin again because I stopped few few years uh, in the past. Okay. And when I uh, build again some cars, this one maybe was the second. So uh, it's static. Everybody think it's on air, but it it is static. Okay. No hair, absolutely no hair on it. It's funny to drive. <laughs> Static to the yeah, bone. It's funny to drive. Yeah, you need, uh, you need some, some serious. You need some balls to drive it. <laughs> you need some serious kahunas to drive it. Yeah, right. So uh, I drive it like that, but you know, Belgium roads. Belgium roads, they suck. Yeah, this one's my single cab with my old, old motorcycle. It's uh, an old French motorcycle from uh, '38. It's uh, leaking a little bit of oil, uh, but, little bit, but that's a good sign, <laughs> you know. Yeah. Part of the game. <laughs> this one also is static. Very comfortable to drive. This is badass. Even if everybody thought it's not, but uh, yeah. <laughs> As you guys told, just like me, Gianni yeah. is a big fan of Star Wars, yeah, just but. A little bit. He likes to take it to the next level and creates his own helmets and costumes and this is just the beginning of it. We'll show you guys more later in the video. But let me show you guys a bit more of the sick cars. I remember this one from a photo shoot we did a few years ago. Still on the way, still driving. Still running? Still running, yeah. Just take a look at these parts. Also handmade, nothing bought. 
just take a look at this guys this is not a slow car yeah <laughs> tell us a bit more about this one yes yeah normally this car is the first uh, water-cooled Volkswagen car I mean by normally K70 yeah I mean by normally it's it was so now I decided to modify it because I want it very low and the uh, mechanics and engine doesn't allow me to going very low so okay. I decided to change everything so I say yeah why not put some Volkswagen old Volkswagen air cooled engine okay. on the rear and that's what I did with my friend so now the engine, the engine is not in the back in the front is it's in the back and the front just uh, just uh, empty <laughs> fuel cell empty. Fuel cell, the beam, the beam is a modified type 1 beam. Type 1 means a bug beam. Cool. Uh, lowered, static. On the rear, uh, the mechanics from the Volkswagen Beetle is, uh, has been rebuilt and, uh, you know, cool. with gearbox and engine. I needed to make a roll cage because this car wasn't uh, done for allowing a big uh, heavy engine on the rear of course because it only was a, a wheel emergency mm -hmm. yeah. wheel so <laughs> nothing really strong to to get the yeah. the, the, the engine uh, stuck so you know, you know i love these so, parts yeah of the roll cage it's, you showed me before how you made them from uh, the nascar okay you know nascar has it i really love those parts yeah it's cool it's cool yeah so Next, <laughs> what do we have in the corner? This is this one is a 55 oval on air rides, lowered and uh, tranny raised, uh, lowered beams, uh, narrow beams, like we do usually. This one looks like very, very, very in a terrible condition, but if you look closer, if you go inside. You can see everything is new. Paint inside is new. Channels, new panels, new pans, new everything, new cool. brake, uh, mechanics, everything. But we keep the old crappy look. look because we like it. That's it. Cool. Yeah. This one is my notch 68. Also static. And uh, I can tell you, nobody believe me when I say it's static, but it is. So we drive it like that. We need some balls to drive. Have a look, guys. <laughs> but it's cool. It's cool. That's low as beep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's funny. This is the most famous car you own. I don't know. Yeah. If you type in on Google Radical Bugs, this is one of the first cars that shows up. Uh, yeah. You're aware of this, no? What? <laughs> if you type in on Google I didn't, Radical I never, Bugs, I never put radical was in Google, so. <laughs> type in Radical Bugs on Google and you'll find out. Yeah. This one, uh, yeah. A lot of people hate it or love it. Why? No How can you hate this? Oh, it's easy. <laughs> you know, it's the the perfect car uh, for purists to yeah to hate. I can imagine. Yeah, you know. So there was a lot of work. Still needed a lot of work, but it's drivable, mm -hmm. and it's and I drive it for more, almost ten years, I think. And uh, each year we go uh, on the road with this. It's not a load, but okay, you know. Sometimes it's funny. Cool. So, yeah. Let's try to take a look inside. Yeah. It's not like a Volkswagen anymore. <laughs> it's not a Volkswagen anymore, but it's cool. Like, insane. Everything has been built. 100%. There's no 
Nothing no, bought, no. everything built. Spare parts uh, from uh, somewhere else. How big are the rear tires? It's uh, 18 inch. 18 inch? And, yeah. and in the front also? It's uh, 16. 16, sorry. Uh, it's still funny to drive, really. Some of my English friends knows that because each year my friends come in from uh, London to to here and uh, he, he really wants each time to drive it so <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine it's funny it's really funny and you have the American way a hot rod this is a Vox rod and, and this this is my hot rod, uh, hot rod. from uh, 30 it's a Model A you took me in a drive with this car to the oh, gas yeah? station. I yeah, remember. I think oh, yeah. three, four years ago to the gas station oh, yeah. to fill it up. Yeah. That, was that was a very cool drive. <laughs> Noisy. Noisy but cool. Yeah. This one comes from Miami, from my friend Yarel, who built also a really, really nice car. He's a really nice guy. Cool. So, yeah, I went there, I drove it there. And then I bought it when he wants to, to sell it. Okay, cool. Really, really cool. Really cool. Uh, remembers. <laughs> yeah. As I told you before, Gianni is just like me, also a big Star Wars fan. And let's go and see how he makes them. We will put the link down below in the description if you're interested in Star Wars helmets. These are just to see, just made, not finished yet. They need some paint. Of course, it's the ones from uh, the New View movie. It's from Rogue One. How cool are those? Yeah, it's uh, some of them is 3D paint, uh, 3D printed, and then mold it into silicone. It's a lot of stuff before doing this, but uh, yeah, that's uh, funny to do. It takes a lot of time, but you know sometimes you need uh, some some relaxation, and it's quite relaxing. So yeah, those are very cool. Have a look at the details. We'll show you guys a bit more later on this video of the whole Star Wars happening. That's cool! Awesome day that was and now we're off to Ghent because I got a business meeting in one hour and a half so we need to rush hey guys I quickly quickly changed at home and um, I have to go to my meeting I'm running very late so if you like today's video thumbs up subscribe and see you guys tomorrow bye bye